We've seen Odell Beckham Jr. throw the ball in the past. This past Sunday, we saw him running the ball in for a touchdown against the Dallas Cowboys. And we already know about his ability to catch the ball. So that gave me the idea. Why not make an entire offense of Odell Beckham Jr.'s? If you guys play Ultimate Team and you want to get some coins, make sure to check out my sponsor link in the description, muttreserve.com. Use my code CK and I promise you, you'll be rich one day. But in the meantime, you'll get 15% off. Off your order welcome back you guys your boy ck now that's not all we did as you can see the defense is a 93 overall an entire defense of the 6 1 280 plus pound animal aaron donald all right so let's begin with the originals and just look at their stats so odell's a 91 overall wide receiver 5 11 198 27 years old with six years of experience amazing speed agility you know there's a reason why he's one of the best after the catch you know 96 change of direction 90 99 spec catch 96 jumping you might be surprised to find out that his rating at wide receiver is only the third highest odell on our offense man there are two other positions where he's a higher rating one of those positions was tight end apparently odell would be a 95 overall tight end man i guess they didn't factor in the run blocking yeah as you can see he's a 39 overall blocking tight end so we're gonna struggle in the run game if we have like two tight end sets but vertical threat amazing in running back he's a 99 this this one makes a little bit more sense odell I, yeah they need to start running the ball with him more often in real life I, I know the browns have kareem nick chubb but you see how dangerous this man could be with the ball in his hands so I, yeah he definitely needs a little bit more carries in my opinion even though he has amazing throw power for wide receiver like top five i believe it only translated to a 25 overall this is relatively high and i'll take it okay we're still an 80 something over offense so that's not too bad now the original aaron donald of course is just an absolute specimen of a defensive lineman or should i say just of a defensive player in general man how many interior linemen have 82 speed and 90 acceleration to go along with 99 strength and 99 awareness man this dude yeah certain positions like cornerback he might struggle a little bit only a 68 change of direction but everywhere else on the field with the exception of secondary he's at least a 94 most places he's a 99 okay we have one of the best defenses in the nfl man all these players have 99 play record amazing tackling the hip power is incredible we're gonna get to the quarterback we're probably gonna lead the league in sacks like this is just gonna be a scary thing for other offenses to go up against man i can't wait to see the numbers these aaron donalds end up putting up on the board but yeah right end he's a 99 left end 99 d tackle you guessed it linebacker he's a 99 in terms of outside linebacker left and right but mlb he actually dropped to a 94 that's because you know the coverage stats aren't amazing but that's still really good one of the best i think he's like top two mlbs in the nfl cornerback is where he dropped off a little bit man the cover stats being only a 25 I actually messed up on one of them gonna go fix that real quick right, so now we got that out the way man i, I definitely love paying attention to details so uh i had to make sure every single player had the same stats so i appreciate if you can go ahead and destroy the like button man take the two seconds to make that happen but anyways free safety he's an 84 yes a d tackle is an 84 at safety bro who else is doing this i know he did taste him i know he did isaiah but this might end up being the best team we've had so far 88 overall when it's all said and done and uh yeah let's just go ahead and see how they're doing halfway through the season six and two ahead of lamar and the ravens all right let's go ahead and play against deshaun and the texans bro imagine 11 aaron donalds running full speed at you on the kick return i'm definitely fair catching all right first play donald open field okay big hit coming we all have hip power. Be careful. Oh, my goodness. Like, we might get burnt over top. But if you catch it in front of us, just say goodbye. Like, I didn't even check the stats. I should have. I guarantee you we're up there in terms of obviously tackles for a loss. So even if you don't think the offense is the best, I got to be honest. Is there a better defensive player for this type of experiment? Man, who is going to be this high of an overall? Who's going to have this high of an overall if you put them at every position on defense? I can't think of anyone else. But that's where you guys come in, man. Let me know in the comment section who's next. There are a few maybe that could contest like Bobby Wagner. You know, we've already done Dern. We did Isaiah Simmons. None of them were this high of an overall. But hey, the Donalds did their job. Now it's time to see what Odell can do. All right, here we go. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, I almost squeezed through. Nice tackle. I'm looking at tight end Odell. That man is a mismatch. That man is a mismatch, but I don't know if he can throw it that deep. I don't know if he can throw it. Ah! 
All right, we're going for it on fourth. I, I'll be honest, I didn't expect them to have a spy. So, you know, this time, even if they have a spy, we're just going to take off. Actually, our one's wide open. We got to make that throw. We have to be able to make that one, baby. Odell getting the easy first down. You got to wonder what this man's throwing stats are. I mean, we're six and two, so it can't be that bad, right? Maybe they just run the ball a lot. Maybe we're just, uh, you know, a pound of rock type of team. At least that's what I'm going to assume, man. We have 299 overall running backs. We better be running the ball a lot. That's all I'm going to say, man. There we go. Nice block by the wide receiver, Odell. Odell getting us close to the first. Are you sure you want to give Titan Odell free release? All right. Don't matter to me. Oh, yeah, triangle. Great release right there. Ah, the accuracy. It's all right. We're going to go for it. We're going to get it. I'm going to audible to a run, and this should be an easy conversion. Fourth and one. What did I say, man? Let's go. Man coverage again. R1. I don't know if we can throw it accurately. Thank God we got hit. That was probably going to be intercepted. We will take our three, man. I'm confident our defense of Aaron Donalds can get enough stops for us to win. 82 speed linebacker. Not half bad at all. Not half bad. Great tech. And we don't even have to talk about the D-line. There is not a combination of any player that would be a better defensive line. Because I'm pretty sure he's the only 99 overall D lineman. Second closest would be JJ Watt. But I don't know if JJ is as fast. I don't know if he would be as high of an overall as Aaron Donald at some of these other positions. So it'd be kind of tough. Look, look at the speed. Yeah, I'm pretty sure our defense is the reason why we're doing so well. But I don't want to sleep on o Odell. I mean, hey, it could be our run game. Look at the bull rush. There's nothing you can do. All right, so first quarter's up. Now we're going to go ahead and simulate and see if we were able to pull off the W. Bro, why can't we score? Why can't we score? Thank you. Finally have the lead. And we're going to keep it, baby. Nice W. 25 overall Odell. Somehow had a better passer rating than Deshaun Watson. Running back Odell had a touchdown, 74 yards. Receiving wise, it was, you know, very well well spread out the actual Odell had the only touchdown receiving wise in the game and then defense Aaron Donald went crazy okay I knew we were gonna have a lot of tackles for loss the sacks though six of them things man we were just you we were just getting after them all right so we end up 12 and 4 first in the division Odell had a decent season at quarterback man almost 4,000 yards 26 touchdowns 14 interceptions 61 percent completion percentage hey I'd say that's pretty decent that's like middle of the pack in terms of what you want from your quarterback running back he killed it 1200 yards and 10 touchdowns the other one had 431 and 11 touchdowns even the tight end odell got two touchdowns on the ground quarterback had one touchdown receiving wise the ball was just being spread all over the place to all our different odells three guys with 800 plus receiving yards and then we had three guys with five plus touchdowns now it's time to see what aaron donald is able to do we had two guys with over 100 total tackles three guys with double digit tackles for a loss three guys with double digit sacks the fourth had nine and a half now interceptions we only had four on the season that was you know our weakest position on the defense you know all guys were in the 60s for the most part i'm curious to see where they ended up though let me go ahead and check that all right so on offense odell got to a 39 overall from a 25 that's plus 14 crazy amount of progress right there man the running back was already 99 wide receiver he went up to a 94 you love to see that man tight end got all the way up to a 98 so offense improved a lot defense you can't really improve from 99 so d-line stayed the same linebacker they actually went down because i guess you know some of these outside linebackers were forced to cover and they weren't you know amazing at covering so they probably dropped an overall a little bit mlb actually went up from 94 to a 95 safety went down both of them from 84 to 82 and the cornerback stayed the same yeah we weren't very good at covering but hey we still had a great record so i'm curious to see how far they were able to go man we were 10th in offensive yards so on the entire offense of odell's was 10th in the nfl an entire defense of aaron donald's was fifth in the nfl we scored the ninth most points with a 25 overall quarterback defense second in the nfl for points allowed just amazing but we didn't win mvp it was that bad man aaron Rodgers. we didn't even get anyone in the top 10 that's unfortunate man opoy in the afc we had nobody dpoy come on we have to at least have one aaron donald there you go i'm pretty sure that's the d tackle version best qb i don't expect us to be in here oh okay okay odell squeezed in at number 10 right behind fitz magic best running back no question Odell at number one wide receiver. Yeah, none of them really stood out. You know, it was collective effort. Best D lineman, Aaron Donald, number two behind DeForest Buckner. And then look at that, three total in the top 10 for best D lineman in the AFC. Linebackers, nope. Like I said, you know, they actually got worse somehow throughout the season. Same with the DBs, so I don't expect us to be in there. Look at all these Colts, what the hell? But there's one thing left to check. How far was a team of Aaron Donald's and Odell Beckham Jr.'s 
able to go, man. Okay, so we won in the wild card round versus the Titans, 38 to 14. Odell had three touchdowns, 287 yards. He's outplaying these normal quarterbacks, man. I don't believe it. I truly do not believe it. Man. I have no idea what is going on, but I'll take it all day, every day, man. We were just getting after the quarterback, bro. <laughs> so many sacks. That has to be close to like a record in the playoff game. Anywho, we ended up moving on to divisional round. And we beat the Chiefs pretty handily, man. 42 to 21. I know our defense could, you know, hold most teams, but I didn't know they could hold the Chiefs and Patrick Mahomes. Like, that is crazy. Odell did his thing. We, we're built for the playoffs. We have a great running game and a great defense. So it kind of makes sense how we're able to beat some of these teams, man. I, I'm looking at some players on the Chiefs and I'm like, maybe they might be nice for this experiment, but it's all up to y'all. Whichever one you wanna see, man. Let's see how far these people were able to go first before I get carried away, man. So far, they are killing it in the playoffs. Conference championship, we beat the Patriots 38 to 10. Like these aren't even close games. I don't understand what's going on. Our defense is that dominant, but how's our offense doing this? How's Odell at a 30 something? He might be in the 40s now. How is he doing this? This is unbelievable. Maybe he's just taking off, but yeah, then again, we didn't see that much rushing yards when we checked the season stats, so I don't think it's that. I have no idea what it is, but I'm happy. Okay, we went to the Super Bowl, played against the Cowboys, and you know what happened over the weekend? That didn't happen this time. The Cowboys actually come out on top, man, 31-17. But we made it to the Super Bowl. That's the best season, the best experiment we've seen so far. We're making a full team of one player on offense and one player on defense. Odell actually had his worst game of the playoffs, zero touchdowns, two interceptions. Dak was pretty much the opposite. We still killed it on the ground, man. Our run game, the run version of Odell is nasty. If you're doing a fantasy draft and you have Odell, you need to make sure you put him at either tight end or running back because that's where he will drive for you. That's his highest overall positions. Donald, you can put him almost anywhere in the front seven and he will be absolutely disgusting, but preferably just keep him on the defensive line. Either way, I'm trying to think of a better combination. What two players can you think of that can help us win a Super Bowl, not just get to a Super Bowl? We're making progress. I feel like each time we do it, we get closer and closer. This one was really fun. Hopefully you guys enjoyed watching it. Please take two seconds to like the video man it helps the channel a lot subscribe if you're new around here hopefully you have a good rest of your night and i'll see you on the next one